What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Haley. I am 20 weeks pregnant so this video is going to be a pregnancy vlog just explaining a little bit about my pregnancy and the symptoms I'm having and everything else. So if you want to see more videos like this please subscribe below and don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you don't miss any future videos. Let's just get started for today. So I am officially 20 weeks. I do know the sex of a baby, so I'll be telling you guys that in this video, which is so exciting. We had a gender reveal in Dallas at my fiance's parents' house. Let me get into the symptoms real quick, and then we can talk about the gender. I'm finally really getting a bump. I'm probably gonna have to get some maternity genes pretty soon. I had some with Kaya, but I wasn't expecting to get pregnant so fast um, after Kaya. So Kaya is a year and a half, you guys. I don't, I didn't really say that in any of my videos. So she's almost to um, the due date. Oh guys, oh my goodness. I am awful. The due date of this baby is Kaya's birthday, so I don't know why I didn't say that in any of my previous videos, but uh, the baby is due on Kaya's birthday, um, February 11th. I was due with Kaya on the 15th, and this baby I'm due on the 11th, which is the day I actually had Kaya, so we'll see what happens. I'm hoping I have this baby a little bit early, just like I did with Kaya, but we'll see, so... Let's hope, like, everybody needs to be praying for me right now that I don't have this baby on Kaya's birthday. I would feel so, so awful, but I'm sure they'll share birthdays for the rest of their lives anyways, so they'll be used to it. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to need to get some maternity clothes. I'm getting more comfortable with wearing, like, tight stuff now since it's, the bump is looking like a real bump instead of, um, just like I'm, I'm, I'm full or something. Such a weird thing that started coming out in these last few weeks. I'm peeing, like not not peeing, like yeah, I pee often, like every pregnant woman. But like anytime I sneeze or like cough or anything, I swear I pee a little bit, which is awful. I did not have this symptom with Kaya at all. Um, I've also been having pretty bad sciatic pain this pregnancy. Uh, every once in a while my sciatic nerve will just really be like flaring up like it'll hurt all the way from my lower back down to, into my thigh so I know that it's sciatic pain just because I've read about it with um, my first pregnancy but I didn't have it at all with Kaya so I don't know if that's maybe I'm maybe I'm bigger than I was with Kaya at this point or um, you know I'm, I'm not really sure but yeah that sciatic pain has been really bad to continue on back the other day I was taking laundry out of um, my mom's washer and it, her washer is really, really deep. Uh, so I was taking laundry out of her washer machine and putting it into the dryer and I totally like pulled something in my back or tweaked something in my back and all day long I could like only lay on my side because it was hurting so bad. Your muscles when you're pregnant are a lot um, more relaxed and so it's a lot easier for pregnant women to pull muscles at night time um, when I'm sleeping my stomach has been getting really really hard uh, so I don't know if I'm having like Braxton Hicks contractions I'm, I'm not even sure like can you have Braxton Hicks contractions this early in pregnancy but um I, it must be something because when I'm sleeping at night my stomach like gets really hard and it'll wake me up I also wake up probably about five times during the night I'm not sure if that's because um, because like, I don't know, like my mother Jean is kicking in or something or preparing me to have this baby. That's why I have these bags under my eyes. But, um, but yeah, I wake up, at, I wake up about five times per night and I go right back to sleep, but it just kind of sucks because I'm waking up in the middle of my sleep and it's not waking up from the baby moving or anything. It's just like, I just wake up before with Kaya. I slept, like, I, I swear it was like, I fell asleep and I like, obviously didn't wake up until the morning and then felt like I forgot how I fell asleep because I fell asleep so fast this time I'm able to stay awake and I really think it's just because um I'm, a, I'm already a mom so like <laughs> I have more things to worry about than I did before I'm feeling the baby a lot more now I can kind of feel like the like you know like wavy movements where you know that they're like turning their arm or turning around or those big movements it's still not so much as it will be like in my third trimester or anything like that I can't tell like oh this is the baby's head this is the baby's butt I can't really tell like that but um the movements are just slower and um 
I feel them pretty much all day long after I eat any meal. After I eat um, a meal, definitely the baby's just running around. If I drink a lot of water, the baby is just moving a lot. So um, that's nice. It's nice to have that validation. Like, okay, I feel the baby move, so the baby's fine today. Kaya is pointing. Like, I think that Kaya can tell that my stomach is big she obviously doesn't know at all that there's a baby in there but she will point at my stomach and say baby just because I keep telling her like baby like it's a baby in here and she'll be like baby baby and then she'll like give my tummy a kiss and stuff and it's freaking adorable like I, she's gonna be the best big sister in the entire world I just can't wait to see her like with the baby um so yeah she does point at my stomach and say baby and she'll like rub my tummy and stuff like that but that's only like really if I'm getting her to do it. Kaya, not really knowing, she jumps on my stomach. I don't know if you guys, if any of y'all are moms of toddlers and also pregnant at the same time, but she jumps on my stomach at least once a day and I have to try so hard not to get like so upset or freak out on her, but it really freaks me out because if she jumps on my stomach too hard, I'm worried that she'll like actually hurt the baby. At this point, I'm going to tell you guys the sex of the baby. We are so excited. I will insert our gender reveal video right here. Before you do it. One, two. another baby girl I am just so excited because this whole time I've really wanted sisters um, and I just wanted them to be like best friends obviously who knows if they actually will be or not but I have a little sister and we're seven years apart so the distance kind of made us like always at a different time in our life like you know she was a little girl and I was a teenager so like I was cool like way too cool for everybody figuring out my life so like she was too young for me then and she became a teenager and she was too cool for everybody. I was in high school, so it's like, I'm looking at her and she's like, <laughs> we were just in such different stages of our lives. Now that I'm 24 and she is in college, we get along a lot better because it's like we're kind of getting to that stage where we're both adults, you know, we, we obviously get along great now, <laughs> not a lot better. Now we get along really well, we can talk to each other about things that are actually relative to each other's lives instead of it being like, me talking to a child. So I really wanted Kaya to have a sibling that was close in age so they can hang out with the same people, they'll get to play sports together hopefully in high school or whatever they enjoy doing. They don't have to play sports if they don't want to but uh, they'll get to do stuff together and they'll always be close in age and I just think it's just perfect. Dakari, of course, of course, of course, every boy wants that little boy so he really wanted a boy. <laughs> he was really sad at first if you guys saw that in the gender reveal obviously. But he's excited to have a healthy baby, of course, and we have a name picked out. We're trying, I'm trying to teach Kaya her sister's name, and it's so cute to say sister and everything like that. So I'm trying to teach her her name, see if she can get it. It's hey. Hi. Can you say hi? Say, how are you? Hi. <laughs> You're so sweet. Okay, so Kaya did wake up during that section, so I'm going to try to make this video really uh, fast from now on, from this point forward. So, yeah, we do know she's having a little sister. Can you say sister? 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 But, yeah, I'm going to yeah. go ahead and try to end this video here because uh, she's going to be really wild, but I'll show you guys my stomach um, so you guys can see it and compare your tummies to my tummy. Um, let's see if we can get her to say baby. Kaya, where's the baby? Where's the baby in mommy's tummy? Baby? Baby. Baby. <laughs> so here is my stomach. I'm hoping you guys can see it. Front. My stomach from the side at 20 weeks. Pretty big. Here's my stomach with a no shirt on there. I'm gonna finish the video right here so thanks for watching i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did enjoy it please press the like button and if you aren't already subscribed don't forget to subscribe and turn on those post notifications so that you guys get um all of the updates for future videos say bye 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 <laughs>